Hello friends, welcome to automation community. Today in this video, we are going to discuss an example on any elevator logic. So we will use some normally open contacts, normally closed contacts. We will also use memory bits. We will also use some functional blocks, timers, T on, TP and so on. So let's look at the example first. Elevator logic. The elevator should stop at e each floor for 5 seconds before moving to next floor. So let's assume the elevator takes 10 seconds to move from one floor to another. That means the motor which is used to move the elevator should remain on for 10 seconds to move the elevator from one floor to another and at, at each floor it should stop for 5 seconds. So motor should be on for 10 seconds and it should be off for 5 seconds and then again it should be on for 10 seconds and then again it should be off for 5 seconds. So let's move to eco structure machine expert where we will draw a ladder diagram for this elevator. I will open Eco structure machine expert basic. I will keep read protection as inactive and write protection as inactive. I can also set a password here for read protection as well as write protection. Then I will click on apply. Then I will go to configuration tab. Here I will select a logic controller. I will select TM221C24R. I will click on it and then drag it to here. Do you want to replace? You may lose some features and associated configuration. I will click on yes. Then I can also go to serial line where I will select protocol as TMS2GDB and then click on apply. Then I will go to programming tab. So here I will be drawing ladder diagram for elevator. I can also click on this for a full screen mode and then zoom into it like this. So firstly, I will insert one normally open contact. I will assign address to it as I 0.0. .0. I will also add symbol to it as start button. Yes. Then I will insert a coil. Here, I will assign address to it as Q 0.0. I will also add symbol to it as elevator. Yes. Then I will insert a timer here for elevator. I will change type to it as TP time pulse time base as second and preset value as 10. So the elevator should move for 10 seconds and then I'll insert one more coil here. Then I will assign address as M0. I will insert one more timer to stop the elevator for some time at, at each floor here. It should be T on. I will change time base to 1 second preset value as 5 and then apply. Then I will insert normally closed contact here. I will assign address to it as M zero which is a memory bit and then I will insert one more normally closed contact here I will assign address to it as same as elevator that is Q 0, 0.0 then I will click on this option and then draw a line like this 
So when start button is turned on, elevator will be on for 10 seconds. That is, it will move from one floor to another for 10 seconds. And then after 10 seconds, that is on reaching the next floor, it will stop for 5 seconds. And then again, after waiting for 10 seconds at, for example, first floor, the elevator will start again and it will move to next floor for 10 seconds. And after 10 seconds, it will reach another floor and that at there, at for example, second floor, it will again wait for 5 seconds. It will again stop for 5 seconds. And after waiting for 5 seconds or after stopping for 5 seconds, it will again move to next floor and it will take 10 seconds to reach, for example, at the third floor. And on reaching at the third floor, it will again stop there for 5 seconds and it will repeat the process. So I will exit full screen mode. I will compile the program. Then I will go to commissioning and launch simulator. Then I will start controller to do so click OK. Then I will go to programming tab and set full screen mode. So when I turn on start button, elevator will move to next floor in 10 seconds. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So it had reached to the next floor and at there it will stop for 5 seconds and then it will again move to next floor and it will take 10 seconds to reach to the next floor 7 8 9 10 and it had reached to the next floor and at there it will wait it will stop for 5 seconds 4 5 and then again the elevator will start for 10 seconds and it goes on it was all about this video. Thank you for watching.